just a short trip down this lane is McCormick Distilling Company, a business that's been around 150 years. It takes its roots back from the early 1800s. But spirits aren't the only thing that's produced on this land. This site was originally a meat packing plant, and you can still find evidence of this past in the ancient cave, an old natural meat locker. It is a, an integral part of, 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 of the, the site. And it's actually, uh, it's actually, we think, very neat. McCormick began in 1856 on this land, thanks to some very special geography. The reason that they chose this location is that we are sitting on a natural limestone shelf. And the water that's filtered through that limestone uh, that we use to make the bourbon. And for 150 years, McCormick has accumulated a lot of history. McCormick was actually the uh, producer of all the Elvis Presley decanters. It even survived the Prohibition era. This one was able to stay open by producing medicinal alcohol. Although this site no longer produces any spirits, it does about everything else. What happens here is all design, all marketing, all bottling, uh, all shipping. What's surprising about this successful company is their commitment to the environment. They even named one of their green efforts after 360 Vodka, an eco-friendly product produced in the most efficient way possible. 85% recycled glass, post-consumer, 100% uh, post-consumer uh, paper labels. Uh, reusable caps. 360 Vodka's huge success kept the owners of McCormick Distillery eager to do more for the environment, and so Forest 360 was born. Trees absorb carbon, and this uh, this is a part of an effort to reduce our carbon footprint. It looks nice too. From their amazing history to their eco-friendly commitments, McCormick Distilling Company is just another reason we are proud to call it home. Christina Medina, NBC Action News.